Welcome to Mama Sue's Kitchen. Hope you're having a good day. And I'm gonna tell you, I think, I think Satan wanted to not let me video today, but he's not gonna win because I was showing you how I put together a freezer meal. I had it all put together and it was not recording. When I went to stop it, it had not recorded. So I already have it put together, but I'm gonna tell you how I did it. I'm doing this freezer meal for <clears throat> when I have my surgery and you know, if, if I am having treatments after it, I wanted to have some meals in the freezer so Harold could fix us something good to eat when I didn't feel like cooking. But what I did, I bought eight by eight aluminum pans because that's a perfect size for us. This is chicken spaghetti. And what I did, it was ve it's very simple and I'll have the recipe on my website, which is mamasusouthernkitchen.com. But I took three, well, I took spaghetti and cut, uh, broke them in about three inch pieces. I did two cups of that and I cooked them normal. And I put it in my colander to drain. And to that spaghetti, I added one can of cream of mushroom soup. I added one small onion chopped, a fourth of a cup of bell pepper chopped, and two chicken breasts that I had cooked and chopped. Then I added one cup of chicken broth, a half a teaspoon of Lowry seasoning, a teaspoon of black pepper, and one cup of grated cheese. Mixed it all together, put it in this um, aluminum pan, then I sprinkled a half a cup of cheese on top. I'm gonna put aluminum foil over this, and then I'll put this, and I'm gonna put chicken spaghetti and the date I made it. And on the day we want that, I'll take it out of the freezer and let it thaw, and then I'm gonna cook it on 350 degrees for 30 to 40 minutes until it's bubbly, and this will be a delicious meal. Now, I'm sorry that you didn't get to see me put it together, but I was still gonna share it with you. You know, things happen, and my uh, video just didn't work, but you can see how it looks before it goes in the freezer. I want you to know I appreciate more than you ever will know the prayers that you are sending up for me. I feel them. You know, I was so down because I had to wait for my MRI, but that gave us a chance to go and spend two days with my precious grandchildren in Louisiana. And y'all can be assured that I am holding baby Blake and I will be back today to have the MRI tomorrow. But y'all, God's in control. In 1 Peter 5, I think it's 5, verse 7, it says, Cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you. Most of the time, I will tell you 90% of the time, I am so, my roller coaster is on the top. But there's times that it's beginning to come down a little bit and I have to remember God's fighting this battle. It's not mine. I can't do anything about it. So I'm going to be salt and light. And I thank you for praying. I will be back. And I'm sorry you didn't see me put together this casserole. But it's going in my freezer. And I thank you for watching me. And y'all, please go to YouTube and find Mama Sue Southern Kitchen and follow me there. Watch the videos there also. I love each of you. Bye-bye.